Look at this, sunny 75 and snow. What's up guys? So when the sun comes out, it makes me super pumped. Yesterday it was kind of cloudy. I was trying to be pumped because it's my birthday weekend, but it was tough. I was very tired, but sun's out, gun's out. So we got Hill. I'm surprised he's not Snapchatting me right now. Well, he's about to. And it's my birthday weekend, so I'm excited. This will probably go up Monday though, so it'll be past my birthday. My birthday's Sunday, December 20th, everybody. But we're headed down to Turtle Island with the machine. I bought some stuff to put down there and I brought lunch. I'm excited. And then later on, we're picking up a Chevy Blazer, so it's gonna be a good time. So let's head out ribbon. See, look at it. He's always Snapchat. <laughs> uh, all right, let's load this thing up and get out of here. Reckon 401 traffic. It's trying to pass here, these damn truckers. Three miles an hour. You got your flash on, Bill. It is very cold without a bell of clava. <laughs> it's brewed. Just getting her ready for tomorrow. We're gonna have a few people down here for my birthday since cops can't come down here and charge us. What's the limit now, Hill? 25? Is it 25? I guess outside's fine, it's 25, but indoors is only five people. So stupid. Hey, if you're gonna get it, you might as well get it, right, Hill? That's what they always say. If you don't, you will. So we're just chopping up some wood here. We got Razor J. Lush has begun up the river. Wonder how long till she freezes over. The edge is starting to freeze. Imagine if she stays below freezing for a couple of weeks here. She'll freeze right solid. The only issue is it gets cold and then it gets warm again. So it starts to freeze or it does for like a day or two and then it just breaks open. So we shall see how it goes. See any fishies in there? Uh, of course that happens. So I didn't even check the battery on the drone, but I haven't charged them in a while. And you know, over time batteries do drain out. And, it, and it, uh, I was chasing a bald eagle over there and I was on my way back and it decides to get an emergency land. So I canceled it, but it was already on that side of the river over there. So it's like, I'm landing either way. And it had 1% left. I'm like, frick, I could probably make it back, but Luckily, I just steered it into the grass super fast and it landed. So it's over there. But uh, the thing is, the river's too deep to cross here. So we got to go all the way to the end, 10 minute tour, and come all the way back. Oh. All right, here we go. <laughs> I was just flying along the riverbank and it decided when it was about 10 feet out, it, was, uh, it only had one 
percent battery left probably should have checked that my bad <laughs> and then yeah it i canceled it and then i just cranked it to the left and just made it over i guess there's ice there i could have landed on that but we got her we're good to go let's throw another battery and try and see where we end up same thing's gonna happen <laughs> yeah let's go across the river again <laughs> hey, at least we didn't get wet get stuck on a pile of shit. <laughs> uh, Carhartt sent me a birthday gift. Uh, thank you for being such an amazing partner in 2020. Thank you, your friends at Carhartt. So nice. What did they send? Ooh. Carhartt Christmas hat. Wow. Nala dog coat. Wow. Nala's getting famous. We got a cookbook from Carhartt. Oh, this looks like some sort of bag. And, oh, a Guinness. I think it's a beer holder. Yeah. Look at that. The Guinness six pack holder. <laughs> That's amazing. Thank you, Carhartt. You're the best company to work with. I love you guys. Uh, I want to know what this is. What do we got here? Oh, it's a dog. I think it's a. I don't know. <laughs> I think it's for the back seat of your car. I believe, for the dog. Or just a really warm blanket. Either way, I'm happy. Thank you guys. All right, let's go pick up that Chevy Blazer. The old Blazer. We haven't had a Blazer since, uh, I think Sandy's Blazer last time when we jumped it, the whole frame snapped in half. Hopefully she doesn't fall off the right. We, gotta, we can hit some deer, help. <laughs> Get some dinner. She's got a bit of a cancer. <laughs> Sweet. Well, let's bring her home and jump her. Back to the old compound. We do have some fun here. I'll give you that. What should we do with this thing? Come in sideways, try and roll it. See if we can snap the drive shaft. What are your thoughts? Jump it. Jump it. On that one, too. Get it over. You can jump it. <laughs> Everything's still pretty frozen solid. She was thawing a little today without sun, but she's minus one right now, so it should be. Uh... Man, I want to ride my dirt bike. Look at these jumps. Jumps and jumps. Mark was here. <laughs> Let's see what this thing's got. 
I mean, I said that the other day with the Jeep and then I blew the drive shaft out of it pretty quick or the transfer case or whatever goes on underneath. But uh, I truly believe in this thing because we haven't had any blazers. I think this is the second blazer we've had, so. And it smells good inside. Good luck, everybody! <laughs> This thing is like the Jeep except on steroids. Way more fun. I think it's a little smaller, so it, it kind of feels like a go-kart. What are your thoughts, Hill? <laughs> Alright, a couple more rips then. Uh, I'll take you for a spin. Yeah, bud. Good one. Two seventy one kilometers, boys, not miles. Here you go. Yeah, buddy. Do I scare you? Yeah. We're gonna try. Here we go. Woo -hoo! Big jump. <laughs> <laughs> this thing is just a freaking big go kart. Oh, 
She'll be nice and slick from that sun today. Oh, big bump. Round and round we go. There's the fence right there. Barrel. <laughs> what do you think we can get her up to? Oh, hold on tight. Oh, too much fun. Oh yeah, we got dirt everywhere here now. Dirt city. Holy cow. I'm just put it everywhere for you. There we go, Hill. Wow. This thing's cool. <laughs> Isn't this thing the best? You're just doing a... <laughs> this is one of the best cars I've been in that you're doing this with. <laughs> That's why you gotta love the 4x4s. They're just so much fun. Whoop! <laughs> smells pretty good too. Doesn't smell like butt. <laughs> you dizzy yet? No. No. bought 400 of these for what I paid for the Maverick <laughs> and this thing is way more fun oh man I love it you're gonna get that freaking van out of the way though it's really blocking our entrance to the freaking pond you got a bumper <laughs> you want to try and push it I don't think this thing will push it but we can try From what I've seen this Jimmy will do anything it's a blazer oh. Not bad. Wide open? <laughs> Do you imagine this push the other way? We might be able to push it back. <laughs> Not even budging. No. Oh, you got a new burnout place though. Some dirt burnouts? Whew. All right, well, a couple more donuts and we're out. Anyways, 
Thank you guys for watching. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you, Pat, for the vehicle. Unreal. And yeah, I got, I got really nothing else to say. I think we're tapped for vehicles for a bit. Hopefully we can get some of these cleaned up in the next couple weeks before or after Christmas. But if not, I'm just going to keep looking for 4x4s. So if you guys got any 4x4s, let me know because I'll take them. Because I can do this shit all day. Thank you guys again. Have a fantastic day. We'll see you later.